Do you ever have intense food cravings? Well, in this video, I'm sharing three common reasons for having food cravings so that you can begin to understand your cravings. Hi, I'm Jamie, registered dietitian nutritionist, and my goal is to liberate you from the struggles of eating well so that you can feel amazing in your body and nourish your way to a healthier you. So if you wanna eat better in a balanced and mindful way, click the subscribe button and tap the bell to be notified every time I upload a new video. If you've ever found yourself constantly thinking about a specific food like nachos or bacon or cookies to then only indulge and go overboard, well, I'm gonna share with you how these cravings happen so that you can begin to target the culprit of your cravings and eat in a balanced way. So food cravings happen for a number of reasons, but here I'm gonna share with you three of the most common reasons that you may be having food cravings. Number one, restricting food. So if you're cutting out carbs or sugar in an attempt to eat less, or if you tried to restrict the amount of calories that you're having in a day, if you're not getting enough food energy, this is gonna trigger cravings, likely in a response to your blood sugar being imbalanced because your body isn't getting the essential fuel that you actually need to function. And when your blood sugar falls, your body needs energy. And the way it gets energy is through carbohydrates. So that craving that you're having, whether it's for pasta or bread or cookies, that part is kind of subjective, but basically your body's hungry and you need quick energy and sending that signal or that craving is your body attempting to get that energy that you need. Number two, a nutrient deficiency. So if you're not eating enough food or enough variety of foods, or your body's not able to absorb those nutrients from the food that you're eating, then this is likely going to be a cause of a craving because it's a signal that your body's gonna send to you, basically alerting you that something is off. And this could be a need for macronutrients like calories, overall energy, or carbohydrates, fat, water, protein, or it could be a specific micronutrient like salt or iron, magnesium, iodine, or folate, etc. Number three, poor sleep. When you aren't sleeping well, this lack of rest and rejuvenation is going to alter your body's balance of hunger hormones by producing more of the hormone ghrelin, which increases your hunger and your appetite and sparks those food cravings. So if you're ready to kick your cravings by addressing how you approach your nutrition goals, instead of restricting foods, finding a more balanced way of eating, or maybe getting to the underlying cause of some of those cravings by addressing the nutrient deficiencies, or maybe for you it's more of a lifestyle thing where you wanna target your poor sleep or the way you move your body, my new program, Mind Body Nutrition Reset, is going to help you target those underlying causes for food cravings. So if you're interested in that, I've linked it in the show notes below where you can find out more information. And as always, if you found this video helpful, please click the like button, be sure to subscribe, and hit the bell to be notified every time I upload a new video. I will see you next time. Take care.